Whoop. Hello guys, welcome back to another video. In this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to create classes and IDs in your HTML code. So let's get started. Here you have an open text editor. So in the previous lectures, we have created this much and our website looks like this. So our heading, subheading, our paragraphs, links, images. So if I want to change my sub different subheadings if I want to change this uh, pixel uh, 20 pixel and this one would be 30 pixel so how would I will do so we will create classes uh, and as well as IDs uh, and IDs we don't prefer because uh, it will execute only one once so in classes we can use it at multiple times so let's get started so here we have our h1 h2 and paragraph and our links so it will edit our css code all my subheading so my all subhead heading will be orange so i want to edit it so let's go to our html code i want to change let's go over here my h2 tag so first my h2 tag then type class tag and then your anything would be let's say first so this is the next control s just go to css and then after this you can type let's remove this no first we have to do this then dot then you have to type first and uh, then this uh, and then go some to edit over here let's say our font would be so here it is font size would be here it is font size uh, 30 pixel Control S and let's see change our sub second subheading class sorry then uh, second would be let's say and then change it dot second uh, let's say font size would be uh, let's say 20 px and my th third subheading uh, here it is let's edit here class uh, uh, third you can type anything so control s dot uh, third uh, let's say font size would be 10 pixel let's control s to save the file let's see how it looks so here our subheading are similar so let's change it so you can see that uh, our subheadings changes so this is the bigger one largest one then this much and this then the small area so you can uh, create and differentiate our your tags uh, using classes and ids let me show an example using id so if i will choose id over here id attribute so let's delete this thing so it will give you like this so let's say third control s and you have to save this as a hashtag not dot let's say control s so it is same no difference 
so but we used classes at which you can use multiple times so this is how you can differentiate your tags and use multiple times uh, editing and changing your text so thank you guys for watching my video please do like share subscribe it's an i'm signing off